God is just so good, John. He is just so good. time coming to my channel welcome and if you're a returning subscriber <laughs> thank you and welcome back I am hoping for a good day today I know I'm gonna have a good day today it's gonna be a, a whole new learning environment for me and I am nervous but I'm also excited I am just hoping everything goes smoothly today hope I got a good preceptor Okay, excuse the dirty mirror, but um, yep, I got my Moana top, my navy pants, and then I got some compression socks because after being off for two months, I'm going to have to get used to being on my feet for 12 hours again. All right, we are out of here. Oh yeah, let's go. All that I am is because of all that you brought me through. One thing I'm gonna do before a work shift is pray and listen to my gospel music because you don't know what kind of blessings you'll receive and you don't know what kind of things you might block when you talk to God. I just, ooh. My daddy um, was listening to this song one day and I cannot stop listening to it. Like, it's, it's so beautiful to me. Um, I just, <laughs> oh, I'm in my feelings right now. Good God. But um, it is now 6.39. I've made it to work. I've made it to the parking ramp. And I am just sitting here, like, like I said, listening to my gospel music. But y'all, I'm just feeling extremely blessed right now. Like, I... <laughs> Ooh, it's been a long, I'm not even going to say two months because it's been more than the amount of time that I've been off of work. Like, I've been dealing with some mess with work for two years, y'all. I, I just, oh my God, it was this, mm -mm. two years and I just, this fresh start just feels like a blessing <laughs> all I can do is thank God for it but I'm getting ready to go in pretty soon because I want to go in make sure I get to the unit and then swipe in we can't swipe in until 654 so I still got a little bit of time before I can swipe in but I guess I'll talk a little bit about my job um, I'm not gonna talk a lot because I know I talked a lot in the last video but I just wanted to make sure you guys were up to date about everything and I don't really like videos where people just sit and talk I just don't but I just figured I'd talk a little bit about my job. So um, again, I'm working in the NICU now and my orientation is 14 weeks long, <laughs> 14 weeks. So yeah, I'm gonna be on orientation until I believe September 9th. And that, they better not hit my car. That orientation consists of both a working schedule and we have these like four hour classes not every week, but a majority of the weeks that I'm gonna be at work. So 14 weeks of that, and then I will be on my own, maybe. If they said that if you don't feel super comfortable being on your own, um, even after the 14 weeks, it's nothing to extend your program. But I'm here to learn everything that I can learn, do everything that I can do so I can be the best NICU nurse that I can be. And so yeah, that's how my job is about to be, so. I'm gonna chill for a second, listen to some more music, and then I'm gonna go inside. So I will see you guys when I'm able to. And yeah, I'll check in with you guys later. 
I need to stop saying that. I hate saying that, but I'm trying to figure out the best way to like transition off of a clip. If you know what I'm saying. Like, anyways, I'll see y'all later. <laughs>
did not do my stable pretest, did not do nothing. I think that the effects of working 12 hour shifts again had me exhausted because all I wanted to do when I got home yesterday was go to sleep. So <laughs> I'm now going to give you guys a few days of my life this week, maybe the, a week in my life. We'll figure it out as we go, but for right now, it's a few days of my life. So yeah, it's the next day. I'm up. I think I'm gonna go do the test right now because I got up a little bit earlier so that I could get it done before I get to um, class. But yeah, let me show you guys my outfit for today. Then today, I just got on this sweater that my best friend got me. Some scrub pants, of course. And then I don't have nothing on my feet and my feet are ashy. So y'all not gonna see what's down there right now. But I'm gonna go put some socks on, get my stuff together. And then we are going to get out of here. Y'all, uh, there are 36 questions on this assessment. <laughs> Let me rush through this real quick. Like, I'm about to show y'all. Shoot. Like, and they're like full questions. I don't know why I did this. I really don't know why I did this. At the last minute. Oh, there's 40. Oh my God. Okay. Oh, let me, I'll be back. Another beautiful sunrise. It's going to be a good day today, huh? It's going to be a good day. just be it'd be getting me going y'all but it is now 6 50 i did sit in this parking lot well whatever and get this packet done so let me go in because i got about 10 minutes to get in there swipe in and then be in the classroom so i um we'll see you guys later i don't know uh, i don't know how this class is about to go we're gonna see but I'll keep you guys updated and yeah, I'll see you later. <laughs> okay, okay y'all, so it is 8.44. We are currently taking a 15 minute break. Um, again, I am here. We're taking the stable class, which is like the post um, resuscitation slash pre-transport uh, care of sick infants. So they're teaching us what to do before, trans well, after transport um, brings the sick babies to our hospital. So um, it's going good so far. The only thing is I don't really have the attention span to sit and listen to someone talk for hours. Like I'm a more of a hands-on kind of person I don't know if I'm the only one that's like that but I'm more hands-on like if I have to sit and listen my attention goes elsewhere really quick so it's kind of hard right now but it'll get better we just did like a little quiz or whatever and it woke me up a little bit so it gave me the opportunity to like do something and answer questions so um it's going good right now I think we're gonna be done around 3 3 30 so we still got quite a bit to go, but um, it's actually very informative. So I had no complaints. So I came in here because I got to go and then I'm going to go back in and we're going to knock out the rest of this day. So I'll see you guys on the bed. Okay, we are now on a 30 minute break. Um, we decided not to take like a full lunch break or whatever because we're ready to get out of here. So. He asked if we wanted a shorter rank or a longer one, and we chose the shorter one. So I'm just gonna grab me a little snack real quick, go back upstairs. Then we're gonna knock these last two, I think, chapters out, and then we get to go home. So, <sighs> yeah, but I'm struggling. It's cold, like it's freezing, even with this sweater, and the cold makes me want to take a nap. <laughs> but we're almost there, so 
Well, I'm about to get ready to go in there and grab something real quick, so I'll be back. Y'all, I said I wanted to lose weight. I got these. These. And a Snickers bar. I'm gonna be a big back for the rest of my life. Cause this is what the problem is. Oh well, this, it is what it is at this point. Cause I'm gonna eat them all right now. Y'all, I'm out now. It is four o'clock. Looking back at the email, we were supposed to be done at three o'clock. It's four o'clock. <laughs> Whatever, it's another hour really like it paid, so. But I am done for the day, I'm free. I'm about to go clock out, make sure I don't go off the wrong floor. Um, hold, hold on a second. Okay, now I'm clocked out. Y'all, I'm just ready to get home and just chill for a second. Like, that was nine hours of just listening to somebody talk. I just cannot. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just can't. But now I'm gonna go home. I will check in with you guys when I get home and then we will go from there. Hey y'all, good morning. It is Wednesday now. Is it Wednesday? Yeah, it's Wednesday, it's Wednesday. I didn't close out the vlog yesterday, y'all. I was in so much pain yesterday. I just went to bed. I just went to bed. So, sorry for not closing out the vlog once again. Or, closing out the day once again. But, I am... I am on my way to my NICU class right now. It is 10.42. And I have to be there by 11.30. <sighs> I want to talk to you guys some more. But, I'm in a little bit of a rush right now. And, I'm driving. So, I'm going to hang up this phone. And then, I will um, talk to you guys again when I uh, park in the parking room. So, I'll see you guys pretty soon. Okay, y'all. I am at work. Y'all, if I could start my shifts at like 11.30, like around this time, I think I would be great. It's like 11.30 to 11.30. That would be perfect because I have so much energy right now. But um, I am on my way upstairs. I, like I said before, I was, I'm going to a NICU class. I don't know exactly what it entails. I just know they said it's focused on like NICU specific stuff for our unit. So we're gonna see how this goes, but oh. I'm already on the floor. That didn't take very long, actually. <laughs> but yeah, I'm about to go in here and clock in um, and then chill for a second before we start in a little bit, in about 10 minutes. Um, and then after the class is over, which would be, it's only supposed to be like four hours, but I'll let you guys know how it goes. So I'll see you later. All right, I am all done with class. I'm going to walk to my car um, and then I will tell you guys all about how this went before I have to make this <sighs> long drive, but it's for a good reason. So um, let me work to my car and then I'll pick my phone back up for you guys. Okay, y'all, uh, I am back in my car. Y'all, I just went up five flights of stairs and it's not, it's not like the flights where you'd go up one and that's one floor. It's like one, two, and then that's one floor. It's like, it's gotta get better at some point, right? <laughs> Cause I am winded right now. But anyways, um, so I just got out of orientation. So basically what this orientation is, is that um, for the next four weeks, I believe, we're gonna be doing these like unit specific orientations where they just go over all of the things that we're gonna need to know for our job on our unit. So she gave us these binders. There's only three of us in the class right now because there's only three of us that hired in right now. But she gave us these orientation binders and I'm gonna show you guys what we uh, went over today. Okay, so this is the binder that they gave us. Um, they do want us to give this back. So I'm gonna go buy me another binder, but we can keep all the papers that are inside. So she gave us like um, uh, report sheets that we can use and things with important information on it, terms that, uh, that's the wrong page, but these are things that we should know how often um, they need to be changed. 
And then we got like uh, time frames for giving report, drug calculation, examples. And then this is the one I was talking about. Uh, terms we might need to know for our position um, in the NICU, like when people do their charting and everything. But it, this whole binder is broken up into categories. So like for each day um, that we are going to be um, doing this orientation class, the, the binders are broken up into the whatever we're going to be talking about for that day. So today we went over like basic stuff like uniforms, um, uh, things we should know about clocking in, scheduling stuff. And then we got into like the NICU stuff. So we got into like how they want us to do our charting, um, the hugs tags that the babies are going to be wearing, uh, more charting stuff going over assessments, what we should be doing, um, checking for during our assessments and what we, we, and what we should be documenting. Sorry, I'm out of breath. Good God. What we should be documenting, um, for each of our assessments and then other stuff like, um, newborn care and then, uh, temperature control. And they were showing us how to use the isolate. So there's like a thing right here with the isolates and she went and got one out of the hallway and showed us how to do that like how to set up the isolates and everything and then that's pretty much all we did um for the day and then as you can see we also went over stuff like pain management we use n-pass for the infant they said we use that for every single one of the babies we don't use any other type of pain score so we're going to be using n-pass so yeah it was a pretty informative chill day i will not complain it was only four hours and now <laughs> I'm about to go make a two hour drive that should only be an hour and a half because my mother's birthday is tomorrow. And even though she called me the other day and asked if I was going down and I said no, and she said good because she wants me to stay down the road and stop going up down the road, I'm going to go celebrate my mom's birthday. I wasn't here for Mother's Day because I was on a cruise. <laughs> But I am not missing my mama's birthday. So I'm gonna make this drive. I'm gonna suck it up even though I hate traffic and traffic is the reason why it's two hours long. I'll do what I gotta do for my mama. So I'm on my way to go to my parents' house. So I am going to put all of this away, reset my seat and everything. And then I may or may not pick up the camera um, when I get to my mom's house because I don't know what we're gonna do for the rest of the day. If I do, I will see you guys then. But if not, thank you for tuning into my channel. And I'll just say all this stuff now, just in case. But if you enjoy my videos, if you are enjoying this video, I have a lot more coming. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit that notification button, because I am going to be consistent with y'all, like I said. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.